Hi and welcome to Dr. Mix. Today I will be talking about the subject, how to make it in the music industry. Now not all of you may know, but on top of being the head of Dr. Mix, I am an artist in my own right and uh, I go by the name of Sunlight Square. I like house music, I like jazz, I like Latin music and soulful music and I'm lucky enough that I get called around the world to perform gigs and to collaborate with international artists. And all I did is apply the rules that I am about to tell you. Number one, act like there is no music industry. You remember the time when we thought all I need to do is be discovered by a big record label and they put me up on television and I'll be famous and everyone is gonna, that time is gone. That's not gonna happen. If it happens, it happens only if you've done it by yourself to begin with. So there is you, your art and your power to entertain and how you're gonna play your cards using the internet platform is gonna determine the success of your project. You can do it. You can do it by yourself. Number two, be original. Today is not the time to be making predictable music. You have to be original. That's your power. That's why people are interested in music, because it's original, because it's new. If you want to be inspired by other artists, by all means do it and use that as a way of developing your own style. But just don't try to be mainstream to please people. You don't have to please people with your music, you only have to please yourself and you will find along the way people that think like yourself and they may become your fans. Number three, produce more music. Don't take ages to produce your track, mix your track, master your track, then think in it all over again and mix it all over again and produce just one track per year. Produce 10 tracks per year. It's better just to get it out and stand multiple chances for one of those tracks to stick. Please don't fall for the trap of paralysis from analysis. That will work against you. Release more music, you will get better at it. Number four, tell your story on social media. It's there, it's free, why not use it? People want to know your perspective. People want to know why you get up in the morning and make music. Everyone wants to be an artist. People have a natural admiration for human beings who decide to take an artistic path and make music and do something different with their lives. It's also the dream of being a musician that people are interested in. So why don't you share it? Share it with pictures, with photos, with videos, and use the social media to get the content out. Number five, study what successful independents do. You know that there are a lot of YouTube sensations? Justin Bieber is one of them, to begin with. A lot of musicians made it just using the internet. Study what they did. Pick the one you like, doesn't have to be Justin Bieber, and study him or her. Get the concept of what they've done, do it your own way, and do it about your music. Number six, make videos. Everybody is lazy, everyone wants to see content that they don't have to make too much effort to consume. Videos are perfect for it. Have you got one of these? You can make videos. You always use this. You're probably using this to watch this content right now. So all you need is a little bit of light, point the camera to yourself and show me how you make music. Show your project studio. Show when you go out for a gig. Share your thoughts about music and being creative and about your process. They don't have to be long videos. Just snippets of it will do. You can also study a little bit of editing. That helps a lot. But the most important thing is that people keep on seeing your face. Dress for the part. Well, even if it's not a great dress, be unique. You know, this is like classic show business American style. They have their clothes, they have their hats, they have their looks. And you don't have to be beautiful. I mean, you cannot be as beautiful as I am. <laughs> Just be a character. Audiences are interested in people who look different, who behave differently. So do that. Be that. You're not that. Fake it until you become it. Number eight. Be consistent. Make music regularly. Post about your music regularly. Use the social media regularly. And be present so that the people that are interested in you and your art are looking forward to what you produce next. Number nine. Be humble and improve. Look, music is very deep. It's so deep you cannot touch. You can try and master as many aspects of the art as you want, but there will be always somebody who knows more than you on some aspects of the music or the production or the entertainment. Learn from them. 
The moment when you think, I know everything, is the moment you've finished being an artist. Be curious, be humble, and improve. Number 10, and this is my last tip for the new year, make music for the right reasons. I know that we all want to be loved, I know that all of us need attention, but that cannot be the only reason why you make music. Be genuinely in love with the art form. It's one of the few things that gets this humanity better, so you might as well make music for the right reason, so that you can do it for a long time. Having said all that, Happy New Year from me and the Dr. Mix team.